And just like that, we're in China. Hello from China. Today is, well technically it's day two of a 25 day trip around China with the Dragon Tour. So I'm doing the China Loop trip from Hong Kong to Hong Kong. And our first real stop here is a town called Yangshu, which is where I am now. And it's such a touristy town. Um, it's really surprising. I did not think that China would look like this. I don't really know what I expected, but definitely not this. So this morning we've just been been exploring the town, trying all of the free sample foods that are in the shops. And then this afternoon we're going to do a Chinese cooking class which I'm really looking forward to. Over the next few videos I will be taking you around China, showing you what I get up to. I think it's going to be a real surprise because I think we're going to be seeing a lot of China um, and I can't wait to show you that as well. Hopefully surprise you about what China really looks like and what you can do here and also show you um, what the Dragon Trip can offer. <laughs> So our cooking class has started but before we go to the cooking school we've come into one of the local markets. Now we've been told there are two markets to this market. There is the veggie market which is what I am in now although they have still got a lot of live fish and frogs which is not very nice to see um, but then they've actually got a live animal market as well for the meat. I mean this is China I guess isn't it so I don't know, I don't really want to have a look in because I feel like it will kill my heart. Um, but I feel like whilst we're here, maybe we should see it. Tara is the tiny one. They got okay. the big one. They also said, yeah, on the other side, the big one like this. Okay, yeah. thank you. Oh my gosh, there are rabbits. What's the fuck? Oh my god. And there's a dog. So it came into the um, live animal bit and then we just saw, I think you're used to seeing chickens and ducks and then we saw rabbits, cats and well I saw a dead dog first and then I just saw the live dogs as well. And there's a greyhound for fast food. And there's a greyhound for fast food. <laughs> You've got to humour the situation. Uh. The third dish we are making is with this box of goodies and this is going to be dumplings which I cannot wait to make. a river to go rafting, getting back on the bikes, going to some caves, hot springs, mud baths. I think it's going to be a good day. So we're 
in our rafting part of the trip right now and it is so peaceful. What does it feel like, Laura? Like Venice. It feels like we're in Venice. I mean... <laughs> I'm really glad that we're on these little seats and we're not sat right directly on the bamboo. That would not be nice. nice um, it would be nice and cool. We're very, very hot. You can't tell already. A lot of sweat going on. Um, but yeah, this is super, super nice. The Rumba Rapids. I should remember those. Drayton Manor. <laughs> yeah, Thought Park. We're about to go oh down. Traffic number one. I'm scared. Oh. 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 inside the caves. I actually didn't know if I was going to do this and I turned out to be first going in. Look at this. Well the mud bath was really really fun and now I have kind of got clean and we're about to go into the hot springs. <laughs> So Chinese hot cupping is something that I've wanted to do for quite some time and here in Yangshu there are loads of massage parlours and they all offer it. So I'm about to get some hot cups put on my back and I have no idea what it's going to feel like. How does it feel? <laughs> it feels like tight. It doesn't hurt though. I can imagine a bit uncomfortable. Yeah. <laughs> I swear it is like 100% humidity and we just walked over a thousand steps to the top of this mountain. Look at this view. So we've just come to Xingping, which is about an hour away from Yangshao. This is a super old town. I think it's about over 1400 years old. So it has a lot of history. It's now been turned into kind of a really popular, obviously touristic place, um, but it is really, really beautiful. And then after this, we're actually going somewhere. Well, on the tour, it's called Sally's Village. Um, obviously that is not the real name of the village, but Sally is someone who used to work for the Dragon Trip and she is from this village um, and then they included it within the tour so that we get to see a local village. See I tell you that the red colour is the happy colour right, the yeah, lucky colour for the Chinese people. <laughs> I must say, I cannot get over how beautiful this place is. Um, it's just so amazing and it's so lush and green, but it's just like mountains for miles and miles and miles. I just did not expect to, well, no, I did expect to see this thing kind of thing in China, I did but at the same time I didn't and it really makes me feel like I'm in kind of Thailand but also in Laos um, and Vietnam which isn't surprising because we're not too far away um, considering like how big China is. It's just really, 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 really beautiful. I mean, we've seen some obviously, not some, some not great things. Obviously the meat market was very hard. Um, yesterday we were just in the town um, and we saw these like little baby turtles that were like live and they were being turned into like souvenirs and stuff and seeing things like that is really sad and I feel like it's just the way that people in China do it so I guess I kind of expected that but I didn't know if, how much we would see um, but yeah it's just very very ups and downs in the last few days like really good things kind of not so good things but as far as scenery goes as for the first impressions of China it's just absolutely incredible. We are all relatives and relatives and the family name of this village is Zeng. 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 Yeah, so all the family names 
of the villagers here all sung. <laughs> Sam is a brother's house, and he's down there prepare dinner for us. He told me already we can sit inside. Oh, it's sit. nice and cool. Yeah, you see. And this is the new house. She got two brothers, and that is the new house also. That one? Uh, yeah. Yeah. New house.